Hi everyone, if you're new here, my name is Brittany. Today I'm showing you a four store haul. It is mainly groceries, but I do have a few things from Tuesday morning, as well as a few clothing items and a few items from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree, I spent um, like $8.00. Walmart was 120 and Target was 140 um, and then Tuesday morning was $40. So there is two items you won't see and that is a bag of potatoes and a thing of paper towels. I left those in my vehicle. Um, so just bear with me. I am recording off my phone. I don't have my tripod um, so I am going to do it by hand. So just bear with me as I get through it. Um, Sorry if it's, you know, wobbly or anything like that. But we're going to start over here with Target. I went in there for a few things that I knew for sure I had. Plus, I had a gift card for $60. Um... All right, you guys. So, we're going to start right here with Target. I picked up three of these uh, strawberry banana Yo Play yogurts. This I like the strawberry banana, mixed berries, and the strawberries. But I would prefer these. And I can't never find them at Walmart anymore. So, I saw them there. And I grabbed the three that they had left. They had the two pound bag of the Good and Gather large shrimp roll um, on sale for $11. So I grabbed that. I grabbed some barbecue sauce, some peanut butter. I found this for a dollar on the little aisle when you first walk in. I'm going to use it to put my um, dish soap and sponges and stuff in by my sink. I needed some of this plus they have a 20% off if you use if you save the coupon online and use it when you use your wallet I grabbed two packs of the California raisins this is also the target brand they were only a dollar these ones sell for three for six so I grabbed the peanut butter and the s'mores also grabbed one thing of Velveeta some oven ready lasagna I got that because I'm making a one pot lasagna tonight I needed some canola oil, so I grabbed that. Let's see. I got some homestyle applesauce, some cherry mixed fruit, some Swiffers. I got the Gain. I also got the Gain small spaces. You can put this in rooms. Uh, we used this in our luggage, and it kept it like really, um, really strong and very fresh. So I picked up two more just to put around my house. So grab this Colgate. These were on sale for $3.99 and then they had a $2 off coupon so it made it only $1.99. Uh, uh, this is our first time that we're going to be trying the Up and Up brand of the Anti-Cavity Mouthwash so we'll see how that is. Also got some Febreze Air, the Gain flavored as well. Um, I needed some, well I did it, my husband needed some Dove Men and Care. Also got the baked Cheetos. I literally cannot find this anywhere but Target so I should have picked up two but I just got one. Also got the Nature's Own Sugar-Free Whole Grain. This has no sugars and it is only 9 carbs per slice of bread. So that isn't too bad if I want to make a sandwich for lunch or something. Um, see, I also got some vanilla wafers. I'm going to make some mini um, banana puddings for lunches. I'm just going to make them as I need it for lunch. So that way the pudding stays good for like 2 or 3 days in the fridge. And that way I can... Um, my bananas won't get brown so fast and they'll still taste really fresh. Um, last thing I got from there was two of these. I really like these um, if I'm going working out or, or just if I'm tired. These work really well and they don't make you crash. They literally last all day long for me at least. So that is everything I got from Target. Let me go ahead and show you my Dollar Tree haul. Um, so from there I got these. Um, juicy juice these I love these um, apple juices but I can only find them at the Dollar Tree so I grabbed two of them and they're only a four pack but well they're not the Dollar Tree anymore everything went up to $1.25 I don't know if your store went up to that as well but mine did I grabbed these two I'm thinking this is what I'm going to use for the banana puddings I tried to get the yogurt cups from Target but they did not have them in stock even though it said they had them in, online so I grabbed two of these and these snap on all four corners so I thought that would be perfect also picked up some Reese's Thins, some Reese's Minis, and these little gummy pizza slices. I needed some bobby pins and two things of puppy pads. These are your best bang for your buck. I have added them up everywhere, whether they're on sale or regular price at Target, Walmart, anywhere. And four here is always cheaper than what you would get elsewhere, at least where I live. Okay, so the next thing, oh, I did get clothes. Sorry, guys, like I said, I'm recording it on my phone. So I did pick up some clothes. I am starting work, and they will have to order my 
um, uniform, so they told me just to wear blue jeans and t-shirts. So I picked up this um, pink t-shirt. I don't think you can see it because I got my flash on, but it's like a baby pink. So I picked that up. It was $6. And then I found these jeans right here. I found these jeans. They were on sale for 8 so I went ahead and picked these up. And I like them because you can have them long sort of like um leggings or you can roll them up to make them capris and i just like how they're made up here they feel like they're very stretchy um they're high rise ankle skinnies they were only eight dollars on sale um it was the only ones that were marked for that price so i don't know if it was like a accidental thing or what but it was my size and they were on sale so i grabbed them that button just fell out maybe it was an extra button Okay, so starting with the rest is from Walmart, and then I have a small thing from Tuesday morning. We needed some Land O'Lakes cinnamon sugar butter. We like to have that for our rolls. Some bushes, original beans. Um, a thing of 2% milk. This is wet because I cleaned it off because it showed it was uh, had milk in the bottom of my bag, but it wasn't open, and it's not leaking anymore, so I'm not sure um, what that's from. But I needed some steak beef steak uh tomatoes i want to make like some tomato sandwiches and then we have hamburgers on the meal plan also got some of these big flour tortillas i'm going to make um some days for lunches the you roll them up with peanut butter honey and bananas and you um put them in the pan to melt them and they are really good and if you want them for lunch and you can't heat them back up i get them really crispy and wrap them in foil and they stay warm all day so i'll grab those also needed some mayo and I go through this like probably every two weeks so I just went ahead and splurged and got the big one I found this zesty ranch dipping sauce it's great value I thought we would try it I got some gum for me some gum for my husband some dirty rice mix we are gonna do some ribs tomorrow in the oven and I wanted to go all out because I wanted some barbecue and I got some light sour cream I found these rolls for 50 cents um, they're supposed to be like hamburger buns, so I'm going to use them. We each have, we found some real good, um, they called them gourmet burgers, and you got them two different ways. So we found those at Whole Foods, and we just got one a piece, so I, I thought this was perfect, and it was on sale for 50 cents. Um, I got some Philly, um, steak rolls, but I'm going to use this to make some shrimp po' boys. That's what the shrimp is for. I got some chicken bouillon cubes. I got some bananas. I always get the uh, green ones, especially if I'm going to make banana pudding or anything like that to be overnight in the fridge. Um, and then also to make those since I'm going to cook them and then they'll be used later on in the day. I always get the darkest green ones I can find. I got a thing of Jiffy just to have on hand. I needed another one of this angel hair pasta. I'm going to add some shrimp to this and make it a meal. I got some fish fry and some tartar sauce because one day we're going to do fish. I just have to find some that's not frozen. Also, uh, they had this on clearance for a dollar, nine dollar eighty four, and then they had this on clearance for ninety six cent. And I thought I would give. I've tried all this before, but this one, the hot and spicy New Orleans style, I've never seen it. Um, maybe it was always sold out anytime I went to the store. So I'm gonna get that and try it, and we're gonna have like some fried chicken. Um, tacos are not on the menu, but I always like to pick up taco seasoning anytime I go because I can use it for fajitas, for tacos. Um, just anything that needs random uh, seasoning, I feel like I can just add some taco mix to it. I got two of the banana cream jello sugar freeze, so that way my um, banana pudding cups will be sugar free and no artificial flavors or anything like that. So it'll be semi healthy, like you're cheating, but you're not. <laughs> I got some pecan turtle delights. I um, also got this classic bread and fish mix. Um, this is used, you can add this for any. Um, seasoning so I'm going to use this for um for my uh shrimp and then I got some hush puppies for whenever I make the um fried fish I will probably see if the HEB has some of that this week I also got a big thing of spring mix because I'm going to use this to make sandwiches salads um whatever I have it and this last is a long time uh sorry my hand was in the way this last is a really long time if you um, keep it at the bottom tray and then you can always pick the bad pieces out that look like they're about to go bad and the rest will be good also got some strawberries they look pretty good I think these were like over three dollars but I really wanted some strawberries um, I 
also got some of these Hot Pockets. These are for my husband's lunch, and when he don't take leftovers, he can have, like, little TV dinners and things. And I don't think he's tried the chicken bacon ranch, so we got those. I picked up some bacon because, Lord, bacon is high. But one day for lunches, we can do, like, BLTs or something. Um, I got some heavy whipping cream for a meal I'm going to try. I got some four cheese blend Mexican style to do like some cheesy potatoes in the oven. Um, I got these for my husband. He likes the dark chocolate sea salt caramels. These, oh my God, are like four something now for this little one. And you used to be able to get them for like two or three dollars. But now they're over four dollars, almost five. Also got some shrimp egg rolls. I'm thinking of doing this with um, some... Um, like chicken fried rice or maybe shrimp fried rice or something. I'm not sure, but I just wanted to keep them on hand. I got a little thing of the ground beef chuck. Um, I do already have some in the freezer, um, but I didn't want to thaw it out. It's a it's a bigger pack of it, um, and I can just use the 80-20. I feel like it gives it more flavor if you use the box dirty rices, so I'll just drain it really well. These were only 322, so I didn't think that was too bad. Also got some brown rice just to have on hand. I got some frozen sweet potatoes. I can throw them in the oven or do something with them on the stove. Uh, maybe like a sweet potato hash. I got some batter mix seasoned fries. I love the great value on this. They, they're not good as checkers, but they're good for a dollar. I got some Ken Steakhouse uh, Ranch. I got some all beef Hillshire Farm uh, sausages. I got some thin sirloin chops. Uh, these are pork chops. Um, everything else was like super expensive. This was actually the cheapest pack. So I'm just going to freeze them like this and use them for something. We might bake them or something like that. They had no chicken again at any of the stores, Target or Walmart. But they had the frozen chicken. So I just went ahead and picked up a three pound bag. This was $7.92. It used to be five something. Um, so it has gone up uh, over, or, or, excuse me, right around $3. But I've used them before, they're all natural, uh, they're individually frozen so they're easy to take out and if they don't have the fresh chicken or like the non-frozen chicken, this is totally fine for you to use for your family, that way you can have different meal options because for some reason I cannot find, you know, non-frozen chicken anywhere else, but this will work just fine. I also got this big pack of the fresh pork spare ribs, um, these are the Tyson brand. I paid $10.46 for these, so I'm going to wrap these up and get them seasoned tonight and let them marinate, and then these will be cooking in the oven tomorrow. I also got a little thing of corn on the cob. This is going to be for a meal. Um, I was going to do it with this, but I'm going to do the baked beans and dirty rice, and that'll be plenty. I also got two bags of the broccoli florets, and I got just this cute shirt. Well, just a little blue tie-dye shirt I just got so that way, and it was only $5. I just got it so that way I could have something to wear um, to my new job until they order the shirts. Now, as far as Tuesday morning, we just got a few things. We got this little um, thing to put on our desk that says, please ask someone else. Um, my husband actually picked this up. He was like, this is what I need <laughs> for my office. So we got that. They had these dog whisper wipes. It comes with 70. They were on clearance for $1.97. So we grabbed those. I grabbed these knives. Um, it's just two pack of the pear and knives. You can use them for cutting fruits or vegetables, peeling, slicing, whatever. It says they're very durable and they're on sale for $4. Um, so I just thought I'd get those to try them out. I got another pack of the wipes. These are the London Fog brand. These are $3.00. And then we found this one shirt. We do have two dogs, but um, this will fit our bigger dog. And it's extra large. It was on clearance for $2.37. And it's, it's a t-shirt, but it says it repels off of, um, it helps odorless and built-in insect protector. And if you look on the back, it says it repels mosquitoes, ticks, fleas, and flies. So I was like, I mean, 237 if it don't work, at least you'll have a t-shirt. He likes wearing his t-shirts, but if it does work, that'll be pretty nice. And then they had these cute little um, containers. I got, um, they were on clearance for $10. They were regular $12.99, so I just picked up, this was the only one they got left. So I just picked this up to put on our TV stand and just have there for decorations. But you guys, that is everything that we got. It was about $260 for all four stores. Um, so 
Well, that is not included in uh, Tuesday. So it was right around 300 for all four stores. So that is everything, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next video. Leave me a comment if you have any questions, and yeah, I'll see you on the next one.